I don't know if she has part dairy in her. Well, that was crazy. So she calved yesterday. Post, I posted the video today. She calved yesterday, and today we come out here, and the calf is in with Lucy. So we're driving around the whole entire pasture. How big is this pasture? Like 12 acres? Yeah, probably 10 or 11. So yeah, we drove around like 10 or 11 acres, trying to find it, couldn't find it. Now all of a sudden we're driving over there, now I look in the corner, and I see just something dark just sitting there. Yeah, that's where it was. So, yeah, it's a heifer. So, yeah, Lucy finally calved. I don't know what took so long, but, I mean, I guess she had it eventually. Alright, so after we found Lucy's calf, came to the goat pen. We saw two up here and three back there, which I'm thinking. Three, five little ones. Yeah, we're not supposed to have that. One of them... Was this guy? Girl, right here. It's a girl. See, this is a new baby. Only problem is, is it is hungry. He's got a really cool colorway. Which one is Dom? Where is it? Not that. It's it's one of the red ones. I don't know where she's at right now, but it's one of the red ones. And the mom either doesn't know it's her baby or something. I don't know. That's a good question. So yeah, we're, we gotta, we're gonna make a little pen and then we're gonna lock them up together and then I'll record that when we get that done. So yeah, it's one of the red something. I don't know what's going on. And it is like hungry because you'll see, like, if you watch it walk, its legs are like full. Come on, walk. Come on, walk. Basically, it's like, say, like, she's walking and it just, like, gives out. So, yeah. I'll record again when we get it off there. So, we got them in the same pen. The baby's trying to nurse, but it can't. Oh, it's fine where the teats are. But, yeah, she has, acts like she has no clue what's going on. But, and the other two that haven't kitted look like that's one of them that hasn't kitted. She is no, like, literally no other. There's another one of these that are white. Oh, another one of the white ones has, like, literally don't even, doesn't even look bred. So, yeah, you don't even know if, if, like. So, yeah, and this idiot back here, don't add babies first. Well, she decided, ooh, that's a cool fence for me to stick my head through. And she goes, all right, let's get out of here. Oh, I can't get out. Okay. And that's the other one that hasn't had anything. She hasn't had anything either, but she shouldn't. Oh, he's got gotcha. So her babies are getting big. Like, look at her udder. It's not, I don't even know it's called an udder. Well, oh my Dawson Foster, how? It's still me. I ain't supposed to be like that. Who knows? I'm gonna grab a Timothy. Come here, Timothy. Timothy Wee. Timothy Wee. And Elizabeth. This is Timothy. This is my sister. This is a boy. That's Elizabeth, my sister, which is a girl. My two up here. This one. I'll grab it. Oh, she's fast. Or he's fast. He's both boys. I'm pretty sure my sister already went over their names. <laughs> what one? If you're going to do the video, do not grab it. this one. No. She actually, she has though. Should we put her in and see what she does, or?
All right, so I was pointing. So that one right there walking back in there, that baby. That's Big Jerry. There's, the other one's named Big T. I don't know where Big T's at. He's, it's that one's brother. Because that one, Big Jerry's a boy. For obvious reasons. Big T, where you at? Let me hear you scream. This is, whoa, whoa, this is, this is Big Jerry, he's got that, no, his name just white, but, whoa. this is their mom, and then the other one over there with the brown spot and the speckled ears, that's Big T, I'm pretty sure my sister went over him, I don't know why, I'll just go over them again, and these two don't have names, because they are just, Absolutely. Nope. Alright, well. So yeah, we then again. So this one here. She was acting like. So we gave that one some wormer that's in there. And then this one's like. All of a sudden acts like her baby's in there. We don't know if she's acting like her baby's in there. Or, does she, or she just heard the feet. So we still don't know who this little girl's mom is. Do you know who your mom is? We got her some milk out of the, that one, which we're assuming it is. Whoa. Oh, and this is all at Timothy and Elizabeth. Yeah. So, he's gonna go get some like, milk replacement or something for goats. There's that guy too, if you can see him. Right over there, nursing. Yeah, he likes to hide, and then all of a sudden he acts like. He acts like his mom just ran away. And he's like, meh! He's like, meh, I want my mommy! And he goes over there and freaking just screams. Well, yeah. Also, I don't think I've said enough about it, but not her. That one's probably ain't even bad. But we have a rooster walking around the farm, which you might be thinking, well, isn't that kind of normal? He got chickens and roosters. Well, this guy, if you can see him, Right there. Whoa. So basically, one of the people my grandpa works with likes chickens and he has a bunch of chickens. So my grandpa let him use her chicken coop. So then we come get eggs sometimes. He gets eggs. So yeah. And then this rooster, he was getting picked on. You can see the like, right on his like, head. As I was saying, this guy, he, you can kind of see his head, like, is all pecked, like, you can see all the little spots where he got picked on and stuff, but, so, he's been out here for, oh, couple, probably about, like, three days, four days, he is a big rooster, so every day, I got a bag of, don't be that I just put somewhere and he finds it and eats it. The other day, I put some there and clean that off. And he does that a lot, too. So, yeah. I'm going to eat him and I'll get you back. Alright, so I feed him as I just got this bucket. Get some feed. It's probably too much for one chicken, but he doesn't even eat also. Now, lately, he's been... Hold on, I can't catch the moment. I don't know what just happened, but so yeah, lately I, he's been hanging out in the back of his corn crib. So that's where I've been feeding him, and it's inside. Just, yeah, he's been getting rain the last couple of days. You can see the oats are coming back up. So yeah, I've been feeding him here. Like you can see where I fed him yesterday, he's all clean, so I feed him right here bigger than the day. We just leave it like that. And then he'll should find it. He should. Open. But yeah, he also does just like walk around and find his own food. So even if I didn't feed him, he'd be fine. But yeah. So there's the rooster story. Hi. So it's a couple days later. And she basically no longer. Then we had to start bowel feeding her for a day or two. 
and then um so yeah basically we bought it our house file fed for two days we're, we're gonna bring her back but we just brought her out here today for a little bit so we can hang out with the goats but yeah there they go and then so yeah that's why she got the collar on and she's very annoying very annoying when at seven in the morning she is screaming. You walk away, she screams. It's annoying. Then also today, um, you probably can't see, but I'll try and point them out if I see them. But we got um, we got a bull that we're renting from. It's, it's we're renting it from. One of my dad's friends, he's somewhere out there. He's a he's a pretty big bull. But yeah, nah, I should I might drive out there. See, she follows you everywhere. And you can't get away, like. Then he's doing crap you don't want him to do, but yeah. Alright, so there's your update. It's like 40 liters, I think, from when I last filmed. This guy, spotted one's getting big. <coughs> Got him. <coughs> and now I. Bleh. Bleh. I need help. I got the poopy hand, the poopy knee from the poopy goat. Bear with me. Alright, well, I have to stop. You guys okay? I thought I turned the camera off. Yeah, and this thing won't start. So 606 won't start because the starter's out. So he took that off and it. I don't know. Things, things don't always want to work through. And we also moved the fuel barrels. They were over there. I think you can probably see them in the background of my videos, but they're over here now because we just, that building, we're going to try and cut some of those branches off that tree and then things can really start clicking. So, so yeah, I'm going to go show you one of my projects. And also my aunt and grandma, they got a garden going. So if you see stuff growing in there and sprinkler, that's what it is. We got some sweet corn. They got four rows of sweet corn. Some stuff back there that I don't know what it is, but I'll show you my project now. So we're walking up on my project here. Sarah, our goat, is buried right here, so I wanted to kind of do something here. So we got all these wood shavings from stump grinding. So basically a couple days ago, I spread all these out. And I decided I dug out spots for railroad ties. And then we're gonna cut railroad ties, set them in the ground. That's probably I gotta do a little bit more work, but this is all full of ants. That's pretty much an ant pile, so I really don't wanna see so, yeah, today my dad's gonna pick chainsaw, cut, 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 and cut, and cut. But yeah, and then I'm gonna transplant some plants, like high studs. Maybe something like wild grass or something, I don't know. So anything I'll grow, basically. Basically. We got this apple tree here. It's starting to grow apples. It's one, I've heard they're sour. Two, I'm allergic to apples, so I will not be eating them. I'm also allergic to mulberries, which we also have a mulberry tree. I don't know why, but on this farm, everything, every tree that we have that grows a food, I'm allergic to. We got mulberry tree in the goat pen. I realized I'm really allergic to those. Now I got we got three apple trees, and I'm also really allergic to those. It's very annoying. So yeah, we also kind of did this. I had a little bit more line there for that because no doubt I don't know what did that. But yeah, this and then we also took all this stuff out. This building, so this building is officially gone and we officially have all the materials 
Not all, most. So yeah, we just gotta, I think my dad's plan is he's gonna pile some dirt around this tree or something. They gotta cut this one off here, right? Well, right there. I don't know if you can see. So he's gonna cut that off and then, yeah, so. Yeah, I don't know what else we're gonna do today, but if we get that little tie thing, thing Bob, done, I'll show you guys that. I'll do that if I see the bull, I'll show you guys. Which I probably won't see the bull because they go, they just went out in the pasture. So they usually go out, walking around for like two hours, then they come back. So yeah. Probably not gonna be able to get down there. You'll see him eventually. It's, he's a, Pretty, uh, like my, my dad said, he looks like he's out of Magford. Like he is, looks pretty darn good. Like, very good. Alright, I'm gonna drive this somewhere. I don't know what she wants. <laughs> You got nothing over here, ma'am. Shut up. All right, while I'm out here, that's where my project I'm doing is, but they're out in corn, so I figured I'd show you corn, which some of it's over my head. Grain that's not that hot, it's not that, it doesn't take much to be taller than me. I'm like full nine. I get a lot of short jokes in my free time. But yeah, let's go in here. Whoa. Whoa. Let's go here, Sid. It's about, yeah, for counting the leaves, they're calling me. So, I don't know if you're seeing around. Oh, oh, I hate this. Maybe it'll be, maybe it'll be like a cool, like, transition. Hold up. Ow. 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 So, yeah. We sprayed this quite a while ago, but it is shot up now that I think of it. See, uh, a corn is doing good. As you can see, you can see these kind of like roots. Now, if my, if I can remember correctly, you this stuff means here that your corn is, it didn't get deep enough. Cause that's like part of the roots and that's supposed to be in the ground. Like here's a good example of what it should be kind of. Should be like that. That you don't want. I mean, it's not gonna hurt anything, I don't think, but it Jeez. Oh god. Oh god, we're gonna die. Hey, we're you get making it out a lot. I literally didn't walk that far. That felt like hell. Hell of a hundred yards. So yeah, this fence we gotta redo sometime. I don't know if we're gonna redo it in this part. We gotta do that part where the sears are, but over here is where we don't. I'm not sure. So yeah, oats. So the oat video. Oat video. No video of us bailing the oats. Pretty sure we just got cheated out of like four rows of corn. But you know, uh, basically, for some reason my dad set the sprinkler on it. I did that. Is that really gonna do much? Is that little spot gonna get so, get so much rain it's gonna produce a lot so then we don't even need the rest of this side? I don't, I, I don't think so. Apple. So yeah, I don't know what else to do, but all I know is we're gonna get rained on. Okay? Oh, it's cold. Oh, it's cold. Oh, that cold. That cold. I got the rain splatter. Oh no. Oh no. It's falling. Oh no. I'll be BRB. Well, again, this is another video. I got the outro on. It's now. It's not 10.36, it's 9.36. I literally think the last time I did this was 10.36. I might fact check. I might, but 
Well, guys, thanks for watching today's video. Hold up, I gotta tell you something, though. That goat, first of all, we named her Tatum. And, so yeah, she came to our house. She's not here now, because we brought her back out, because we gotta leave tomorrow. So, I haven't bottle feed her. But, yeah. So, thanks for watching today's video. Thanks for watching today's video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you in the next one. Peace. What do you want? Uh, I, was gonna, I thought you were talking to Dad. Bye.